this obsession that just has with my pimps. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Oi! Ah! That hurt! Sometimes this balancing act can get a little exhausting. Like, here's the thing. I want to play video games. I, I wish I had more more time to play video games. It's just balancing everything out and I hate this feeling of like when I am playing video games that like man, should I be doing something more productive? See, be productive honestly gets tiring, gets exhausting. You need a break sometimes and, and like you need to disconnect and I don't want to disconnect by reading a business book. I actually like to disconnect with one of two ways, and that is by uh, <laughs> reading comic books or playing video games. Doing these daily vlogs is an like, ah, bleh. doing these daily vlogs. It's an exception, inception, exception. I don't mind doing these daily vlogs. I mean, it only takes like most two hours to edit. Two hours may, you know, be a long time for you, but. It's the end result is what I like kind of get excited for. I love seeing you know that final product. That's that's my art in a way. I honestly don't know where I'm going with this. Anyway, these are the games I'm thinking. I don't need something very complicated because like I said, video games is probably the least thing I do and I wish I would do it more, but I don't need stuff like Witcher, Mass Effect, or those games are amazing. I've played them, but they're just a little too much. They're too much for me right now, and it's one of those games where you really have to invest a lot of hours into it. So as much as I want to play those games, I'm going to eliminate all of those. I need games that you could just kind of like pick up, play, play for like maybe, you know, just a couple hours, you know, not eight hours, maybe two, and put it down. <laughs> I don't need anything like that's too addicting and too... I just need something to like disconnect and have fun and be able to turn it off. So I'm thinking like games like um, like Batman Arkham Knight, Mad Max, I'm very interested in that game for some reason, and and Doom, I think Doom is gonna probably be that, that game that I'm talking about, like that one game where you could just kind of shoot a bunch of monsters, enjoy the violence, and turn it off and, and go on with your life. <laughs> Guys, I have one more day here, so I've already asked this on Facebook and I've considered all the games you, you guys have been recommending me. So I'm gonna ask one more time, leave a comment on you know any games you suggest and I'll consider them. But I hope all this kind of made sense and you guys could probably help me. Remember, I have a 72 hour trip ahead of me. So let me just think about it. I'm thinking out loud, so thanks for listening. What kind of video games do I like or play? Uh, Batman and what's that? Rocket League. You like action, action ones and storyline ones sometimes, which I get into because I'm like, oh my gosh. That's your you time. You work and you dedicate a lot of time to other things, and then this is your everybody has their thing. I think you're a cute nerd, babe. <laughs> you like WWE and video games and like you know. Okay guys, so uh, all of you know that I don't usually talk to the camera ever, even when Jose is recording me, just like I'm probably not going to make a whole lot of eye contact right now, but I am out grabbing a few things for Jose's um, early birthday because he will not be here for his birthday and I wanted to celebrate it before he left, so that's what we're doing today. So right now I am at the comic book store and if you know Jose then you know that he'll be pretty excited with pretty much anything I bring back from this place. So I'm gonna um, take you guys in there with me. I don't know that I'll do a whole lot of talking to the camera, but we shall see. What other stuff are you doing? Celebrate your birthday. Right, I love you. Love you too.
Um, that store is overwhelming. Jose is obviously much better at this whole picking out comic book stuff. So now I'm off to the next spot, which is Best Buy, which that's another one if you know Jose. Then you know that that's like another one of his favorite stores. Off to location number two, guys. Let me not get run over. These are the games I have for now. These are the ones I will be playing, hopefully, if I have, you know, time. City Skyline, Firewatch, Mad Max, and Doom. Present number two, guys. So one more stop to go, and then I go home to see my early birthday boy. Firewatch, what a what a unique game. I like that one. Firewatch is good. That's it. There's just something. There's something awesome about watching your city grow, and this game does it way better than SimCity ever did. Jose called me earlier with this brilliant idea that we should have a donut cake, thinking that I didn't already have that plan. So, babe, I was already gonna do that. You go and ruin all your surprises. So I'm on my way to Dunkin' Donuts right now. So, um. My current situation is that I'm probably behind about like, I don't know, 15 cars because they just opened a Dunkin' Donuts here and these people swear that it's like the best donut shop in the world, which don't get me wrong, I love Dunkin' Donuts, but the hype is way too real out here about this place. I'm not about to sit in this line and go home with like one or two donuts for Jose because this is stupid. I mean, Crazy. I can't imagine opening day. But just check out this line. So yeah, I'll let you guys know. Right now it is 6.30 according to this clock. And um, I'll let you know what time I leave here. I think I got a really good selection. <sighs> Feels good today, you know? Like, I'm telling you, man. Work hard, but also play hard. You know, work hard, but also give yourself a break. It's important, man. I'm not feels good like it feels like a sense of relief and and you need that because that just means that when you start working you know towards your goals and passions you'll just work that much more harder if you burn yourself out you probably won't even make it I mean who am I to give you guys advice I mean I just this whole vlog experience is to show you guys what one goes through trying to to reach the goals and dreams that that I want to reach so one step at a time Remember, this whole vlog is going to keep going until I make it, and that is to become the best photographer in the world and a documentary filmmaker. Feels kind of good saying that. I'm next, guys, finally, and it is now 7.02, and I only got one car in front of me, guys. I'm next. Woohoo! Jess told me to go walk the dog and she'll let me know when I can go back up. Okay guys, I finally made it home and um, this is the little setup. Check it out. I just wanna let you know I love you, babe, and I'm so incredibly blessed to have an amazing husband like you and this is gonna be your best year yet because we're gonna be having our little baby boy and you get to be a daddy this year, so. And I just want you to know that I'm so in love with you. I can't imagine this life without you, and you are the best man that has ever come into my life, and I'm so thankful to God that he brought you into my life, in that now you get to be the daddy of our little boy. So, happy birthday, and I hope you enjoy your uh, donut birthday cake and your presents. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Happy birthday to you. Even yeah, better. Cake birthday thing? Yeah, look at that. Aww. Isn't 
this is nice. Happy birthday, babe. Make your wish. Can't even wait. <laughs> of all the dads in the world, I got you. These are from me. Oh. This is awesome. How do you know? Nice. <laughs> oh. Ooh. This is perfect. When I decided, you know, to like do some high quality vlogs, here's some high quality audio. <laughs> Ooh, you got the nerd in me, babe. Outcast. Batman, I'm Gotham. I've been actually dying to read this one. Nail biter. This have you heard about show. that one? Uh, of course I have. So have you, ever, you haven't read any of them? Mm -hmm. Good. Yep, got you a new one. I wanted to surprise you. You did good. You did good. Happy birthday, babe. Look at you. Hey! <laughs> that was uh, that was very nice. I'm really happy with uh, how this day turned out, even though I just stayed in here. So I just want to let you guys know that the day you're watching this vlog, tomorrow, Saturday, that's the day I leave. It's gonna be a long, long flight. All I'm saying is that it's gonna take a while, no more than three days, I think, without a vlog. So this is um, goodbye for now. Hopefully you guys won't forget about me. I definitely won't be forgetting about you guys. So I'll be uploading, I'll upload a vlog as soon as I can. Okay. <laughs>